himself at home. Track mud in all over me floors. Maybe she'll finally move in with him. High time. I've got a problem. Can we talk? Yes, Geralt? What did you want to talk about? I got a strange message. I don't quite know what to think. Who is it from? Ingrid Vagelbutt's servant. Apparently, Lady Vagelbutt's prepared to donate a tidy sum. She wants to help mages escape from Novigrad. Guessing this wouldn't be a selfless act of charity. You guess right. And that's my problem. Vagelbutt needs a favor from me. No details in the letter, unfortunately. I'm supposed to meet the servant at the fish market. Says he needs to explain everything face to face, but these days I can't be sure meeting him's a good idea. Don't like this at all, but you seem determined. Not about to let you deal with it alone. Thank you. The servant. How are you supposed to contact him? Said I'd recognize him. He'll be in a blue tunic, have a load of keys strapped to his belt. I'm supposed to ask him about the price for his trout. Whose idea you think this was? The servants or Vagelbuds? My bet's on Ingrid. Highborn damsels have a lot more time than their servants to read adventure novels. Think it'll be better if I talk to the mystery man in the blue tunic? He's expecting to meet me. You just wait nearby. I'll make sure that note didn't come from the witch hunters. Then you come in. Mm hmm Fine. Let's meet there. Is it in case the first one breaks? Red, no coin, all is shite. Ow! Don't pull! Well, you wanted braids. But I didn't want my hair pulled. I can't have one without the other. Then I don't want them.
Witcher, Witcher. Kareem, look who's come. Huh. Live here together now? Didn't know. Once you told me Sarah had been responsible for my nightmares, I decided to see if the devil was as scary as they paint him, or her. I came in to find not a fiend, but our little Sarah. And I can't say why, but we took a liking to one another immediately. Long ago, to isolate themselves from a world of beasts, humans began building cities. But since beasts prowl within stone walls as well as they do outside them, this did not allay human fears. The truth is, walls guarantee no one's safety. The place where you lock yourself in and lock all else out, that's not your home. Your home is sometimes a place you travel long and far to find. Jerkins. Interesting. Yeah? Know where I can get the best price on trout? Perhaps. But it wasn't you I was to meet, sir. Want to talk to the letter's recipient? I gotta be present. Caution would advise... Caution's advising you not to argue right now. Trust me. Seems I've got no choice. Come with me. This way, it's not far. Oi, Grey Knight, meet Squire. First time I've laid eyes on him. Maybe. Well, recently someone's been trying to question our messengers about the young Count. Hold on. Where's Miss Merigold? You would come alone, Miss. If not for him, that trio would have dragged you in for questioning. The tall one was Valdo Morris. Works for the witch hunters. Aye, you're surely right, Miss. I it, it just weren't what I expected since Lady Bagel, bud. So what's this about? Be straight. Lady Vagelbud's son, he's the problem. Master Albert's taken an interest in alchemy. Temple Guard's gotten weak. Wouldn't worry about the guard, but since the mage hunters tried to grab you, I'd say Albert's in serious trouble. Aye. Lady Vagelbud bought off the guardsmen. Since the hunters paid for every mage revealed to him. Guardsmen took a bribe from the frightened family and whispered a word to the hunters anyway. Seems Albert needs to disappear as soon as possible. I can arrange that. Think young Vagelbud can slip out of the house unnoticed? Tain't that simple, sadly. Master Albert's in hiding at the Vagelbud's country estate. Lady Ingrid's got the notion she can get him out quietly. Want to throw a lavish masquerade ball. Am I supposed to attend? Help him escape? I will not manage without you, miss. Lady Vagelbud fears the help's being watched. a good idea. A boisterous bash. That'll distract the hunters. Especially if even half of what I've heard about the Vagelbud's balls is true. 
Word is, at the last one, they served a hundred different desserts, and the fireworks boomed from dusk till dawn. What with the war and all, my lady's ordained but 85 desserts this time. Won't be no candied petals or blue roses from the Zare. The roses have become dreadfully hard to come by. Oh, I'd love to see it all. Hope we won't have to stay till the end. You're coming with me? Of course I am. Not about to send you into what could prove to be the lion's den by yourself. Think about it. 85 desserts. While you're still trying to keep your waist at 22 inches. Geralt, please. How do we get to the residence? Your invitation. Take it. The guard at the gate will have instructions for you. You're to wear a fox mask, all right? Good luck to you. Something I need to do first. Fine. Buy our masks while you're at it. And you should change. Ball attire. I bet you can get everything we need for the ball at Eliel's shop. You know it? Been there before. Eliel's a friend of Dandelion's. Just masks, right? Probably don't need to wear a... doublet, do I? A doublet, Geralt. And it's not up for discussion. Take care of that, then come and see me. cold. Greetings. Come to look over my spring collection, perhaps? Glad to take a glance at what you got. Of course, please do.
So long. My dad doesn't like elves very much. Oh! Welcome, Master Witchel. Saw the notice. I'd say I'm interested. That's good. Grand even. Name's Breen Hotch. I posted that slip. Gonna need details. Course, course. Well, through a series of regrettable events, I came to own a spread of forest ripe for logging, near Novigrad. At a distance from any roads, but quite near the port. Easy gold, right? Just hire some lumberjacks and count the coin. Meant details about the monster, not your business. Oh, it's all linked, see? I took on some dwarven loggers, but they came to me, claiming the forest haunted. Thought them lazy, nothing more. Then one day, they went in the wood, and only one returned. Said some forest devil had attacked them. Let's talk about my pay, because the current offer's just not enough. Very well. Let us say that's a price I'll pay willingly. I'll take the job. This logger, where'll I find him? Around. Last I saw him, he was drinking away his pay. Said he had to honor his dead comrades. Drink with me, you cocksucker. Fucking knock back a few so's my mates will race peaceful. Something ploughed them up good, but I don't know what it was. Don't know who or what to cuss. Talk to one Breen Hotch. Told me all about your comrade's death. No liquor. We tried to explain some horror was prowling the forest. He refused to believe it. He's hired me. Wants me to find the beast that attacked you and your friends. Is that so? Well, I take back what he said. Good man, Breen. Though a halfling. Tell me about the attack. What do you remember? We were making our way out of the forest. Loaded with wood like pack horses. All of a sudden we heard a bloody howl. Like a wolf's. Pack leaders. We legged it, but then the cartwheel got stuck. Magnus Rector hollered that I should run to the hut for the crossbows, so I ran. Come back to the woods. Bloody plowing massacre. Couldn't tell me mates apart. Thanks. Really helpful, that. Kill the bugger. Will you?
That's it, Roach. The woman's mad. Unfortunately, I can't imagine where she gets the call. Burn me! Burn me alive! I've done nothing! Nothing? Nothing? Who concocted those poisonous potions? Who helped the Lodge of Sorceresses, sending them reports via Megascope? Who addled men's minds with magic, eh? I know you, Remy. I know you and your crimes. That was long past. It shan't happen again! Oh, we'll make sure it don't. Shackle him! He's cut too! allow this. No one's asking your mind, mutant. Still think you'll listen to me. Or to my sword. To me! At him! Thank you. If you hadn't intervened, they would have killed me. And Louisa and the boy, I, I tremble at the thought. Triss Marigold, find her. Might be able to help you. I hope so. Take this. I must abandon magic for good. You might still find use for it. Perhaps the next time you encounter mage hunters. Yeah, something tells me it won't be long. Farewell. Come on. Logger's hut. We need to find the spot where they died.
deep ruts. Logger's wagon must have stopped here. Then they went down this road, probably towards their clearing. There was a fight here. Two dwarves and something big. Claude the Rock must have been angry and strong. Wounded dwarf tried to flee, bleeding heavily. This one to the ground, so hardy suffocated. Deep wound on his back. Bled to death. Everything says Leshen. A young one. Must have arrived here recently. Need to find its totem. Crows serve Leshens. Should find some near the totem.
Get up. This comes so in time. Why don't you all just get off my back? Welcome, Master Witcher. I killed the Leshen that attacked the Lumberjacks. Oh, that's wonderful. Grand even. I'll have to find some new loggers, but there's no shortage of folk looking for work. But can I be certain, no other Leshen will show. It's possible, I suppose. I have to find a witcher if it happens. Aye, yes, yes. Well, your due reward. I'm not the kind not to pay for a job well done. Farewell. Thank you. 
This is the haunted house. Something clicked. Let's go!
winds howling. Days, air brained all of them. You've seen the new waitresses, no. worth seeing, and how dog sunglasses from the lands already taken by Nilfgaard. Yeah, must not someone to show them around. No. You read my mind. shouldn't give you any more trouble. A little renovation and it should be fit for you to move into. Truly? Why, the estate's price just spiked sharply. What precisely was the problem? Earth Elemental trapped in the cellar. It was just trying to get out. Almost demolished the house in the effort. <laughs> Far more interesting than a ghost, that's certain. And the cellar you mentioned, is it an estate to be furnished? Hard to say. Oh, we shall see. Ah, your bounty. There you are. And uh, farewell. Back again. All over Maybe she'll finally move in with him. High time.
My good sir. Need a bit of grooming. My time's up. So long. off against still waters? Shall you? Shall you? I challenge you to a duel. <laughs> Noble lords and virtuous ladies, another fight is soon to begin. Gentlemen, the Witcher defeats the previously invincible Stillwaters. And what about it was? Freed of his vow, the knight can now show his face. Your blows are strong and true. My congratulations. Thanks. Have you naught to add? I'm a woman. No wry remarks? What for? It's the 13th century. Nothing peculiar about it. Women own taverns, run farms, and fight. Will you not claim there was no honor in fighting a wench? No. I'd expect to hear that from someone who was afraid to lose to a woman. Now only Colossus stands between you and a chance at the Maestro. San Sebastian, that's where you should go. Look for the largest courtyard. Come here! Ooh. Now bring us some victim.
Listen, Arthur! Oh, hey, Master Witcher, will you face Colossus? Folks say those of your guild pack a thunderous bunch. Oh, now you look to be a man in search of exertion. Hey, White Locks, will you dare to fight Colossus? Let's fight. Ah, boring. I'm not interested. Quick I am. Too quick for you. It'll be knick-knack, patty-whack, piss your arm bone. Where's the sport in it? Don't want to fight? Why bother looking for challengers then? Wasting my time. Whoa, a bit testy, are we? A witcher, right? Let's do it like this. You parry three blows I throw your way, you win. But you can't swing at me. Not once. Just deflect my blows. Got it? Catch three of them, and I'll toss you double your wager. Feeling that generous? No, I just know you can't do it. No one's ever done it. Prefer to slap you around the ordinary way. Ah, oh, disappointing. Ladies and gentlemen, a fight, a fight, a fight at last. Standard regulations. Witcher versus Colossus. defeats Colossus in a regulation bout. A captivating clash, to say the least. You thump hard. You thump well, Master Witcher. Thanks. You've earned my esteem, sir. We've not seen such a feat in years. And thus, you've secured the right to challenge the maestro himself. You'll find him by the docks. again. <laughs> God brings peace to our domains. Flout its writ and rot in chains. Long live Duquesa Anna Henrietta. Best cure for the beast, a witcher. Rolling on an empty stomach. Oh, dreadful. Wow, we wow. A witcher has come round to take a crack at the beast. Oh. <laughs> I 
This where I find the boxer they call the Maestro. Maestro, champ, the undefeated. Folk call him many things. You are the Witcher who dropped the three lesser champions? I am. Come to fight the Maestro, but seems to me he's indisposed. Alcohol is the Maestro's remedy for his crippling shyness. He's a delicate man, you see? He'd never so much as hit a pillow while sober. Fighting sober is like dancing to silence. Let's go. I challenge you. Hold on. Whoa. I'm a man of principle. I keep to a code. I don't tinkle where I eat, and I don't fight folk who don't drink. Meaning? Meaning you're to drink, or hey diddle diddle out of here. Sheesh. Oh. Mesdames, messieurs, the maestro will perform at last. Let's do this. When I chop, you'll be bumble. Hey, well done, that under a bus. Yes. not happened in years. Your fists, they're glorious. Thanks. I'm gobsmacked I am. I have to drink it off. Oh, good fight. To speak through, I'm pleased you stripped me of the title. I shall have more time to pursue my chief interest now. Witcher Geralt of Rifia is hereby crowned Fisticuffs Champion of Beauclair. Bravo! Behold your trophy. A life without liquors like loving without licking. I saw.